kids go last. Who pays taxes? The working class. Fat cat profit and kids go last. Who pays taxes? The working class. Fat cat profit and kids go last. We're out here supporting the Chicago teachers who are uh, protesting the reckless CPS uh, bond deals that um, are basically giant payoffs to Rahm Emanuel's campaign donors. Um, they are making themselves look broke so that they can get these bond deals. Um, and it's just making things worse uh, for our schools because we have to end up paying them more money uh, when none of this is necessary, uh, rather than having them loan us money, we should be having them. We should be taxing them the money, um, and and really put a, a financial tax on the on the traders and, and the, the people that have the wealth. You know, we don't live where there's scarcity. We live in a, we live in a society where there's plenty of wealth. The problem is we just don't have it in the right hands. So uh, this is about putting the burden on the right people. Just to show, uh, you know, none of none of these cuts uh, uh, in teachers is necessary. None of these layoffs are necessary. None of these salary cuts are necessary. No school closings were necessary um, because there's wealth to be to be had. It's just with Ronald Emanuel's donors and um, and the people that are they're profiting off these bond deals. Um, it, you know, they they they're getting rich like bandits while we while our schools suffer and while they're overcrowded. Um, and while people's living conditions continue to get worse in an era with the worst income inequality since the 1920s. Libraries, kids need books. Schools need the money that housing took.